Many people say your 20s are the best times of your life. Think about your 20s as like a video game boss that you can't beat, but when you finally do, the payoff is so worth it. I'm 24 years old now, and I've learned a lot in the past four years. Your 20s will include the most challenges, but if you navigate them carefully, you will have the greatest potential to grow. Now, let me tell you what you can do to increase your potential for growth. Let's start out with relationships. When you think of relationships, you usually think of dating, but there are many kinds of relationships. I'm talking about your friends, your family, and a very important one, the relationship with yourself. You want to meet different people with different experiences. Your journey up to 20 years old will look different compared to someone else's. The most important relationship I've learned to maintain is the relationship with myself. Everything starts with mentality, learning to trust yourself and growing with the decisions that you make. Stick with me until the end for the best tip for growth in your 20s. I have to say that I'm a huge overthinker about the decisions I have in my life. I find myself overthinking decisions that haven't even happened yet. We can both agree that worrying about your decisions aren't gonna help our situation. I learned that looking back at past failures doesn't have to be stressful and taking a second to evaluate them can actually be beneficial. You can learn a lot by looking back at these past failures and figuring out what the best decision is just in case that situation comes up again. It's okay not to know everything by your 20s. Not everyone will have it figured out by your 20s or expect you to have it figured out in your 20s, which is why it's okay if you don't know what you want to do yet. It makes it harder because you will have these external pressures that are going to bark at you, but that's okay because they basically just want you to succeed and want you to have that safety. The best thing about being in your 20s is that you're young enough to find out to figure out what you like and possibly want to turn it into a career. There's risk at messing up, but if you're young, you don't have many things holding you back like bills, kids, or time. This gives you the most room for potential to grow. I was able to increase my income by 80% and here's how I did it. Many people will say that they don't have enough money to do what they really wanna do. And it, it really starts with how you manage your money. I have to be honest, I've always been an awful saver, so I had to find a way to make more money than I could possibly spend. The best thing you can do is live below your means. Don't go blowing your entire paycheck on something that will only give you temporary pleasure. Make sure to pay yourself before you spend that money on anything else. That way you have a buffer amount of money for the rainy days to come. I'm not qualified to give financial advice, but I recommend throwing your money into a Roth IRA. Find a solid index fund such as ticker symbol VTI to throw your money into each month and watch that money grow over time. To keep it short, VTI is a index fund that owns over 3,000 companies. And so when you throw your money in there, the money will be dispersed. And if one company goes bankrupt, you don't have to worry about losing all of your money. You'll be paid what's called a dividend and slowly grow over time. Compound interest is your best friend and your older self will definitely appreciate it. A lot of people will say money can't buy you happiness. I believe this is true, but Having a foundation can definitely get you in the right direction. I'm going to share with you the best advice for growing in your 20s. Now, before I tell you the best advice for growth in your 20s, I just wanted to thank you for sticking with me throughout the video. And just do me a favor and bonk the like button and subscribe button as it does help the channel out a lot. The best advice for growth in your 20s is going to be finding a mentor. That's it. Finding someone who can do what you do better is the fastest way to grow in any aspect of your life. It may be a parent, your professor, a friend, a friend of a friend, or possibly somebody else on YouTube. Use YouTube as a resource, but definitely find a credible source for the topic that you're trying to improve in. Graham Stephan is a great example. He makes a lot of good videos on finances, and he definitely helped me out. Um, so definitely go check out his channel. You can also check out Jeff Nippard. He's a like bodybuilder, exercise, fitness type of guy on YouTube. He also has uh, science-based research on his workouts and he's definitely been helpful as well. Finding the right person for what you wanna grow may take some time, but it has immensely changed my life in many ways I can't even imagine. Your 20s can be the best slash most challenging times in your life. You have the single most important factor by your side and that's gonna be time. It's okay to try new things, new ways and situations, new investments, new risks, you're gonna mess up. But be easy on yourself, learn and adapt, and over time you'll learn from your mistakes and come out a better person. So yes, this is a sign you go ask that girl or guy out that you've been wanting to ask out. Go skydiving, 
and do the things that you've been hesitating to do. I hope that this video has inspired you to try something new at the very least. And when you learn something new, do the right thing and pass it on to others. And through things that make us the most uncomfortable come the greatest potential for growth. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video.